Welcome everyone. In this tutorial, I am going to show you the best settings on lossless scale 3.0 to minimize ghosting and flickering issue. So let's dive into the video. Open the lossless scale and follow my lead. First, navigate to the frame generation section. Now select the frame generation type into LSFG 3.0. This feature only available on lossless scale 3.1 version. So make sure to update new version on lossless scale. Now change the mood into fixed. Set the multiplier to. Using this value we can reduce more ghosting and graphical artifacts on any games. Now set the flow scale into 90 or 95. These settings will help to increase more responsiveness. If you are using 1440p or 4K monitor, set this value into 70 or 75. Now navigate to the capture section. Select the capture API WGC. Using these settings, we can increase more performance. Make sure to change scaling type to LS1 because these settings correctly work on LS1 upscaling mode only. Set the cure target to 0. Make sure to limit the FPS because using this value costs more GPU load. Now move to the scaling section and select the scaling type into LS1. WGC with LS1 upscale, you can get better performance. Set to sharpness level 0 or 1. Increase more sharpness getting worst image quality. Make sure turn on performance mode. This will help you get in more performance. Mode select to auto and select the full screen mode. Now navigate to the rendering section. Now select the sync mode into default. These settings will help you minimize screen tearing issue. Max frame latency set to 1. I'm using Nvidia GPU, so I'm using 1. If you are AMD user, set this value into 2 or 3. And make sure turn on raw FPS. These settings will help you monitor lossless scale frame generation on real time with your base frame rate. This is the I recommended setting. Minimize ghosting and graphics flickering issues. I will show you the gameplay video on Red Dead 2. Try these settings and let me know it. This video helpful. Make sure like and share with your friends. And don't forget to the subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.